Hey everyone, it's Lincoln here from fitnesstrainingdownloads.com and I'm really excited to show you something that I've been working on for a while and it's a group exercise program builder and it's really designed to make the programming of your conditioning classes a hell of a lot easier. Uh, now what you can see here is the, the main page that you'll get when you purchase the conditioning uh, toolkit that I've created for you and I populated this with three classes or class formats lean legs total body legs bums and thumbs obviously you can call these whatever you want um, but you'll get the gist of it when I actually show you the individual programs all you need to do is click on each program and then this is actually going to direct you to um, the actual individual program okay now what I've done for you is I've populated this for four weeks I've given you like a four week plan which progresses okay and I have given you a template that you can adapt for your own pleasure or for your own benefit to progress and make sure that your conditioning classes are balanced okay so the lean legs program obviously is designed to work your legs the format of the conditioning classes here is that you have an element of a, a, a high intensity training segment to help release the catecholamines from the hip and thigh area and, the, and to help release the fat from the fat cells and I've populated these slots with different plyometric type exercises so for example we can do 10 high knees um, 10 jump squats and then 10 power jacks okay and then if I wanted to do this in the, the rest based format I will not have a rest in between but as you can see I can decide to have a 30 seconds rest in between okay and so I, that, that's my plan okay so I'm gonna have my clients or my class members do high knees 10 high knees 10 jump squats 10 power jacks and then they're just going to rotate that and I might decide that they're going to do that for five minutes okay then they're going to go on to the conditioning element okay and what I've done here is that I formulated that there's going to be two sections and in each section there's going to be a hip dominant exercise and then a quad dominant exercise and then a plyometric exercise all right so I'm going to, for example, and again, I've pre-populated this with a, a range of hip dominant exercises. So I might decide that um, for this class, I'm going to do a reverse lunge and then a, let's do a um, Bulgarian split squat. All right. And then I'm going to do a squat run as my plyometric exercise so that will be my first section and for the group exercise instructors here I've broken down each week the tempo that you should use so the reverse lunge will be down for two up for two the Bulgarian split squats will be down for two up for two and then ten squat runs okay and then the way that I would teach this is that I would set a time say for example either five or ten minutes and then the class participants will then just circuit these and rest when they want to all right that's how I would do this now the week two if by focusing more on the eccentric phase that I'll be going down for three two one and then lift three two one and then lift week three they'll be coming down for four three two one then hold for two and then come up for two and now on week four they'll be going down for four three two one one hold at the bottom for three two one and then uh, do a concentric contraction for one beat so I've made this easy for you and you can see that you can keep this exactly the same exercise or the same combination the same section and just change the repetitions and then you're progressing your exercise and that's one of the, the flaws that I've found with a lot of conditioning classes that there's no real progression and again for section B to make sure that I can keep this balance if I still want to do an, an hip dominant exercise I could do a forward lunge and touch quad dominant exercise I can do a T squat and then here 
for my plyometric exercise I will do power jacks to really um, get a, a nice little lactate burn for the thighs and again the same progressions are here alright once I'm happy with that this is the cool thing if you wanted to print this out and keep this for your record so you can remind yourself what you've done you print it out and then you've got your program okay so you can take this with you to your class you can write some notes here uh, um, you've got your exercise order you've got each week what they've done um, and that actually then connects to your printer alright so I think this is pretty pretty cool then all you do is return back to here and then return to home page and that's how you would edit your lean legs program total body program again I have a high intensity section here which I've shown before so I can just choose any one okay you can see how quickly this is um, to plan those of you and I've been there myself when you've decided you know what oh, I'm teaching in 10 minutes what can I teach okay uh, you can just go through right, I'm going to do an upper body exercise oh, let's do uh, push up and row okay I'll do a lower body exercise I've got all this choice mm, let me do some sift squats and then I'll do a core exercise here uh, I'll do a V-sit, oh, let's do a plyometric, oh, let's just choose uh, this one, okay? And straight away, you've got a total body circuit section here, okay? Perfectly balanced. Now, again, on this one, for those of you that like to teach longer classes, I've given you the option of having three sections that, again, have the same format, okay? Now... I know some of you may be thinking, okay, Lincoln, these are great, but what happens if I wanted to put my own exercises in? Well, I'm going to address that in a second. Okay, so hopefully that you're going to see that this is solving the, the 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 problem of spending a long time creating conditioning classes, also making sure that they're balanced, but also more importantly, making sure that this actually progresses from week one to week four. Okay. And hopefully you're seeing that you don't need to change your exercises and your programs each week. Just by changing the repetition range and the tempo changes, you're creating a progression within your workouts. Okay, So we've got lean legs, total body, and the good old-fashioned legs, bums, and tums. So all I've done here, I've got my high-intensity section, uh, again, to increase the catecholamines and the release of adrenaline and noradrenaline. And now I've got hip-dominant, quad-dominant, and core, and there's... As they used to say, here's one I prepared earlier, and it gives you an idea of how to create that. All right. So that's just the group exercise program builder. Now, you may have your own ideas how, uh, you know, Lincoln, that's great, but I, I want to put my own exercises in, and that's fine. All you'd need to do is click here in this bottom corner here, and it says the sheets have been unlocked. Okay. And so click again and then you should be able to edit each of these pages at the bottom of the screen here okay so you can see home page lean legs and the print if you go to lean legs and total body progressions you've got all of the elements here and then you can add your exercises in each of these columns okay and then all you'd need to do is refresh the ranges and you're creating your own toolkit and your t your own toolbox of exercises okay so there really is no excuse for you not to create this and make this work for you all right so that's it that is my group exercise program builder i think you'll f agree that there's nothing else like this on the market at the moment um and this is for you uh, if you teach conditioning classes if you want an easy resource that's going to send you save you loads of time but helps you create a program that's guaranteed to progress and that your clients will love and more importantly these routines will help you get results then hopefully you'll add this as part of your uh, group exercise um, armory okay my name's Lincoln Bryden fitness training downloads. Thanks a lot and I'll speak to you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.